device that includes the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2 using the latest version of Red Snow. Of course, you'll need to be on iOS 5.0.1. If you haven't downgraded to iOS 5.0.1, you can do that if you follow our downgrade tutorial. That is assuming that you have your SHSH blob saved for iOS 5.0.1. So let's go ahead and get started and load up Red Snow 0.9.11 beta 1. Go ahead and click the jailbreak button once you have it loaded there. And then you'll see this, the info panel. Now what you need to do here on your iPhone 4S, just tap install, then install now, and then tap next, no need for a password, and tap done. And that is it, folks. You are good to go. Well, there's still one last step, but it's super easy to do. I'm gonna show you that right now. Just watch Red Snow. It'll go through restoring from modified backup, etc. Now it's gonna ask you to please turn on the VPN and settings to trigger the jailbreak. So go back out to the main page of your settings app, turn on the VPN, and then you're good to go. It's gonna go through and perform the jailbreak for you. There's nothing else you need to do, folks. Jailbreak was successfully installed. Please leave the device alone until it reboots. Even if you get that error message like I just got there, just ignore it and let it do its thing. You'll see it reboot just like that. And it'll reboot, it'll come back up, and you should have Cydia right there on your home screen just like that. It is super easy to do with the latest version of Red Snow, you'll see of course, the Apple logo, it'll take a little while to load up here, but we'll, we'll be patient. We'll wait it out. But again, if you are on iOS 5.0.1 on your iPhone 4S or your iPad 2, those are the two A5 devices, then you are eligible to perform this jailbreak. And this is the same jailbreak that, that came out you know, back in January with Absinthe. So if you, if you use Absinthe, it's the same thing. It's the same principle, except what's nice about Red Snow is that it's an all-encompassing tool, meaning you have your downgrade tools, you have your SHSH tool. I mean, it's just everything's packed into Red Snow. So it's nice to just use one tool to get the job done. All right, so we are back up to our, our lock screen, at least. Let's go ahead and unlock our device. And there we go. There is Cydia, folks. So let's go ahead and load up Cydia. You'll get this message that says preparing file system. That's nothing new. I mean, that does that. Uh, it's gonna take a while to actually complete. So we'll just hang in there for a few seconds here. This is getting all the Cydia configured so it's ready to go the next time you load it up and start downloading your favorite apps, tweaks and things of that nature, themes or whatever you like to do on your iPhone. Again, this is for the iPhone 4S or the iPad 2. An iPad 3 jailbreak or the new iPad jailbreak is in the cards, folks. So stay tuned for that because it is upcoming as well. Pod2G from the Chronic Dev Team or an affiliate of the Chronic Dev Team is working on that vigorously. And there is Cydia, folks. I'm a user. So we can start downloading our favorite apps, tweaks, themes, etc. Folks, that is how you jailbreak your A5 device running iOS 5.